Okay guys, um, so what we're gonna do today is we're going to um, set up the HIK Connect mobile app, right? Um, so I, I, I have the DVR set up here right now. Okay, what we're gonna need to do first is we have to make sure that this is connected. So I'll, I'll quickly show um, the picture of the back pane of our DVR right now. So our particular DVR today is the HIK Vision Turbo HD DVR 7200 series no? um, with a specific model number that I'll place right here. No? So basically, you, this is wired connection. So you have to make sure that this is connected onto um, your router and that router needs to have internet. Okay, so let's go here to configuration um, and then let's go to network first. Okay, so you can see here um, that I have it set for DHCP, right? So you can see the IP address that it acquired. If it wasn't able to connect to the network, um, this would be um, blank, no? Um, and you've got your DNS here as well. Okay, so let's move on to the HIK one. So what we're going to do is we're going to connect this um, using first my Android phone, right? So for Android, it's as simple as scanning this over here no um so i'm gonna pop open my android app okay so what we're gonna do is um so we have my camera over here so you just have to scan it okay so open browser okay so you can see here um that you have the HIK for end user and you have one for installer okay so what we're gonna do is we're going to select this one the one for end user okay. so um, it, it opened the Galaxy Store if, if this was on another Android device it would open up the Play Store okay so you've got um, as of today which is July 11 2022 um, what version is this? This is version 4.23.0.0610. Okay, so let's go ahead and install that. Okay, um, now that it is installed, let's open it up. Okay. So, Philippines. Okay, let's log in and register. No, let's let's go pretty fast here. Um, I want to use my email. Okay, um, now that we're logged in, um, so we just have to click this one over here, add device. Okay, um, so we're going to do this via um, QR scan. So you can see the QR code over here on the right, so we just have to use that. Okay, and then add. Okay. Um, <clears throat> we can do the DDNS later on so we can enter an alias here um, you can make this whatever you want uh, I'm gonna make it office because I'm going to install this CCTV in our office Android OS can block push notifications please check the status settings to receive okay Ask me again later. So we have um, this one over here is uh, so obviously this is to notify. Um, this one on the top right is to um, link it. Okay. Um, so you've got cameras one, two, three, four, and then you can hide stuff or not. Authorization service. Okay, that's the one that we skipped a while ago. You've got storage status. High hard drive is normal. 
uh, device version. Okay, configure DDNS. Um, and then you've got remote configuration. Configure DDNS first. Okay. Um, now you can also share it over here. Right? So you can share it with a user. You can share it with an installer. Okay? So we're not going to do that. Um, so you can see it over here. No? Um, we can maximize one. You can swipe to the rest. Okay? I didn't configure the rest. No? Then we can go back over here. Um, let's see what the options are up here. So you've got playback, share settings, add to favorites. Let's say add to favorites. Um, you have... So you can go here and then if you click this one, it will save this um, onto my phone, I guess. Right? Or I can record this. I guess this will go onto my phone as well. No? Um, I can mute this as well. there okay let's meet that first okay um, you can also hit um, if this is PTZ it would pan tilt and zoom um, So obviously I don't have anything that's pan and tilt here. What is this? Okay, if I want to pause something. Alarm output one. I think that only works if it's two-way. No? Select noise reduction method. Okay, um, so that was pretty simple. Very easy to set up. Okay, so now um, we have this in our iOS. So, pretty much the same thing. Okay, um, so now that's uh, done, um, let's open up the app. I believe it's literally the same. Um, okay, we're going to allow this. We'd like to send you critical alerts. Agree. Okay, Philippines. Um, so let's log in. So I'm going to use the same account that I used a while ago. Um, Okay, so um, the device was already here, right? So I can just... Um, hmm. There's an encryption password. Oh, so I guess that encryption password would be... Which, um, let's try entering it. Okay, so it um, looks like that's exactly it, no? So you just have to enter the verification code. And that's it, no? Um, it looks like it's exactly the same. Exactly, exactly the same um, settings as the as the previous um, uh, app that we tested. Okay, um, that's it, no? Um, so 
I guess that's uh, that's all we have. So I guess that's it, no? Um, it's pretty much straightforward um, connecting your phone um, to it. Uh, it. It really um, just takes a couple of steps. Um, and as I shown you, it's easy to set up on Android, easy to set up on um, iOS. Okay, so I hope this has been helpful. Um, Please, once again, if you want to get updates um, with some of the videos that I've been doing, um, please go ahead and like and subscribe. Okay? Thanks, guys.